your smart speaker. Get that feeling. Hot Walk. Amazing, tasty Asian cuisine. Hit News Briefing. Hello, Damien Carbon with you on News Briefing. There's been a massive drug bust in WA, the biggest in Australia's history. An undercover operation saw officers seize 2.4 tonnes of cocaine worth around a billion dollars. It was a joint effort with US police. A dozen people here with links to Mexican drug cartels have been arrested. The Prime Minister says his government has got the balance right when it comes to super tax concessions. The Greens are pushing for a lower threshold of $1.9 million instead of Labor's proposed ceiling of $3 million. Anthony Albanese says there won't be any changes and it'll come in after the next election in 2025. But the opposition's Jane Hume says that's a broken promise. They promised that there would be no changes to superannuation and yet they've backflipped on this promise this week. A young family from India is fighting deportation after their 10-year-old son with Down syndrome was labelled a financial burden to society. Krisha and Anish have started a petition in a desperate bid to stay in Australia after they were denied permanent residency and had an appeal dismissed. The PM says he'll look into the case. A former top US lawyer has been sentenced to life in prison for the murders of his wife and son in a case that's garnered global attention. Disgraced South Carolina attorney Alex Murdoch was found guilty by a jury just 12 hours earlier. The case has been made into a popular Netflix series. And Vanuatu remains under a state of emergency tonight. The island was hit with a cyclone and an earthquake in as many days. Together with Beyond Blue, Australia Post is delivering the goods by connecting millions of households with mental health information. It's another way Australia Post is delivering for Australia. A trio of tries for Daly Cherry Evans with Manly big winners over the Bulldogs, 31 points to six. Jake Trevojevic says the defence was like the Eagles of old. It's nice to play like that. You know, you think about the great Manly sides back in the you know early 2000s, 2011 and whatever. That's that's how they played. So we're just trying to learn from them. Round one continues tonight. Cowboys and Raiders are underway. Then it's the Sharks and Rabbitohs. And the Sydney Kings are in New Zealand. They need to win tomorrow's game to get the final series alive. Cloudy with the chance of showers for Mackay and the Wit Sundays today. Tops of 28 degrees. Tomorrow's looking mostly sunny, getting to 30. It's the daily stories that matter in under 20 minutes. Search the briefing podcast on Listener, download the app now and listen for free.